I said, I want to turn this amazing piece of beautiful desert, and I love the desert. I'm a Bedouin at heart, but I'll turn it into, you know, uh, gardens and lakes and waters and birds and butterflies. <laughs> You know, it's not about these 120 story buildings and the biggest shopping malls and the biggest, the tallest towers. We want to give you back your heart and soul. This is what we want to do. And that's what I wanted to, to, to really, to create a, a community that thrives on nature, love, social uh, values and Sustainability. The way he looks at you, you think. Yeah. He really does. Once we'd bought the land, we used to come with the kids and um, drive in the four-wheel drive because there wasn't a road and sit on a sand dune and say, this is all going to be this amazing development. And it's like, it's impossible. How can it be? Yeah, you know, but here we are. How many years later and it's here and it's a thriving community and it's beautiful and, you know, it's a... And what's lovely is the farm has become a destination. People come from people come from Kuwait, from Oman, from uh, Abu Dhabi. They, they, it's amazing. They say, "Oh, we've heard Saudi Arabia. We've heard about the farm. It's incredible. It's fantastic." The idea really was to have a lot of structure um, and also to stick to a very simple palette of planting and colour in the garden um, that kind of <laughs> reflected what I loved in gardens because everything else that we've developed here is very much both for myself and my father and my father loves lush gardens like he's very into flowers 